As you all know, it's opening day for the 1979 edition of the Minnesota State Fair, which we've been talking about on the newscast tonight. Thousands of people are on the fairgrounds even as we speak, including Glenn Burns, but our reporter Nancy Nelson was there bright and early this morning, and she has this report. It's 7 o'clock in the morning. It's chilly and it's raining, but no matter. The 1979 Minnesota State Fair is starting to wake up. The cars began to file in. There were lots of welcome back smiles and cheer. A few last minute chores to finish. And even if the people found it a little wet or a little early, some of the fair visitors were anxious to begin the day. Of course, not all of them were thrilled at being here. And some were already in preparation for competition. Those of us who come to the fair to eat have an eye out sharply for all the edibles. Do you think it's too early for candy? Oh, these are perfect for breakfast. The Midway is always a favorite, and though the rain was coming down, the attraction was still there. The guessers, the characters, the challengers, the rides, the people watching. The weather wasn't ideal, but Minnesotans were still enthusiastic about the opening day of their 1979 State Fair. With photographer Tim Fisher, this is Nancy Nelson for News Center 11. And that does it for the news for tonight. We'll be back tonight at 10 o'clock. Just.